So here we are. It's the beginning of a new decade, and it's not just the start of a new year, but what can be, as you said, a defining decade in your life and of those you care most about, if you choose to. But let's be clear, your success will, be, will depend on the decisions you make and the consistency of your actions. Now, I'm going to talk a little bit more about that later, but for a moment, consider what's been shared. Roger's powerful vision and commitment for the future of Shackley in serving a pivotal role in transforming sick care into well care, helping people change, transforming lives through our commitment to providing the highest quality products, through an amazing community of caring people, you guys, and through a rewarding and compelling business opportunity. And what about those bucket list trips to Cancun and Australia? Now, they're going to be absolutely amazing, and the real question is, will you be there, and why not you? And new earning opportunities with $20,000 in 2020, the rank advancement bonus, that's going to be powerful. And the question there is, will you earn a portion or all of it? But wait, there's even more. No join fee for new distributors in January. Waived upgrade fees, discounted bundles, global conference in Orlando with some new products and powerful speakers and just a tremendous amount of learning. If you're not registered, you need to do it now. In short, we've set the table and lined up everything you need to create a defining decade for your life in 2020. But here's the deal. Even with all of this, nothing will change until you make the decision to act and then act on that decision. And that message applies to both seasoned veterans and newcomers alike. Here's the crux of this. You're with Shackley or looking at Shackley because you want to change your life and the lives of others. And my hunch is you're not looking for small incremental changes, but for meaningful and significant changes that will impact the upward trajectory of your life. So today matters, and it matters a lot. It's the beginning of this new decade, and it should and can be a defining moment in your life. The decisions you make and the direction you go are big. Changing the course of your life is big. Rant, rank advancing is big. Inviting, sharing, sponsoring, and learning new things can be big. And we want big things and the rewards that go along with them for you. But to do big, you first have to know why you want them. You have to know what your dreams truly are. You've got to see them clearly and why they matter to you. And to get there, you'll have to ask yourself the big questions and answer them honestly, like, what do I really want for my life? Who do I want this for? What difference will it make for me and for those that I love? Who will I become in the process? What does success look like? And then lastly, am I committed to pay my dues and do the work it takes? It's this process that gives you the clarity and the resolve to do significant things because you'll only pursue the big things if the reason why you're doing them is something you care very deeply about. But envision how great it will be when you know this. Look out, world. Well, here's the other great news. You don't have to get there in one giant leap. You don't have to be perfect or know it all. But you do have to start or even start over. And you do have to do the necessary things consistently to create real success. Now, Darren Hardy talks about this principle in his book, The Compound Effect. It's the simple principle of reaping meaningful rewards created through making good choices and engaging in the right actions consistently. Sounds like common sense, right? But common sense is not always common practice. And what's interesting about this process is that even though the results over time can be significant, the steps in the moment don't always feel significant. And often because we don't see the immediate results or payoff, we give up before the rewards can come. Now, I think we've all personally experienced it, or at least I'll speak for myself and then you can see if you relate. Stopping the weight loss program too soon. The scale's not cooperating. Or quitting the piano lessons after six months because I couldn't muster much more than a choppy chopsticks. 
or I've heard of those who stop contributing to their IRA because they need the cash now for some immediate gratification and it's really not adding up anyway. Well, here's my point. What we don't realize is these small, seemingly insignificant steps completed consistently over time can create a significant difference. Now, some of you will remember how Hardy reinforces this point through an example he calls the magic penny. It's the choice of taking $3 million cash this very instant or a single penny that doubles in value every day for 31 days. Now, if you've heard this before, you know the penny option is the choice you should take because you know it'll lead to greater wealth. Yet, why is it so hard to believe choosing the penny will result in more money in the end? Because it takes much longer to see the payoff. Do you remember how it worked? So let's say you take the immediate cash and your friend goes for the doubling penny option. On day five, your friend has only 16 cents. You've got three million. Day 10, she has five dollars versus your three million. You're kind of loving your choice right now and your friend, maybe not so much. But watch how the power of the compound effect starts to materialize. After, day, after 20 days, your friend has about $5,000 and you $3 million. But by day 29, you both have about $3 million bucks. See what's happening? On day 31, the mathematical growth makes the compounded penny worth almost $11 million, more than three times your $3 million. Now, who's the smart one now? Well, I think you get it. You'd all take the doubling penny after this example, although I'm not sure who's going to give that to you. And to be really clear, we are not announcing a new bonus program, okay? Just to be clear. But the real question is, are you willing to apply the principle of consistency to your Shackley business? You absolutely should, because it also applies to the core activities of your business. So what are the pennies or the core activities of our business that we need to be investing in every single day and which will provide a great return over time? It's the sharing of products and creating loyal customers and inviting to the business opportunity and creating new leaders every day. Do you remember last month when Sean Gray challenged you to 30 days of inviting and sponsoring? And then the following week, Jeannie Tuvel on the Mission Possible call shouting yes to what Sean said. She didn't use those exact words, but she meant it that way. Did they think on day three, seven, or even 21, your Shackley business would change dramatically and that retirement was just in sight? Heavens no. But they do know what happens when the right activities are engaged in consistently over time, over months, over years, even a decade. Think about the person who for 30 consecutive days shared and invited someone to benefit from our products and our business opportunity. Think about what they learned. 30 days of experience, new skills and growth layering on each other. Then compare that to the person who gave in or gave up after three days. The committed person had 10 times the learning. Or if someone stopped after five days, six times the learning. But then play that out over 12 months, three years, or even a decade. Talk about powerful. Talk about transformative. That's what Sean and Jeannie were speaking to. They were telling you to invest pennies by engaging in the activity, and the activity of inviting and sponsoring every day by creating new customers and distributors, those who will build your business. They know what that, that, what that can do over time, its results and its success. Now, I love this quote. Successful people are willing to do the things that the unsuccessful are unwilling to do. It's not that they like doing those things any more than the others, but they know they're necessary in order to achieve success. Kind of cuts to the chase, doesn't it? But you see, consistency builds confidence and it builds competence. And those together applied over time will build success in your Shackley business. So what's the message? Put this principle into practice in your business by sharing, inviting, and sponsoring 
every day. Think how you'll grow. So Shackley family, if I had my magic wand and I could wave it over each of you as you leave these meetings and have you do something, it would be that you make a decision. As you return home, that you'll find a place in your bedroom, your car, your bathroom. Find a mirror. Then look yourself in the eyes and create a moment of truth where you make a decision as to what it is you really want and why. And then make a decision. Decide that you're willing to pay your dues for success in your Shackley business and that you'll start now. Please don't miss this opportunity, this great opportunity. And here's where it gets very real though. Let me share with you the benchmark of what I believe is required for you to do in order to build a meaningful business. It's to help three new people get started with the Prove It Challenge each month and help at least one new person each month realize the rewarding benefits of starting their own Shackley business. This is critical to building your business. And the fact is, there are good people who are out there looking to change their lives financially and they need what you have to offer. But you have to offer. Will it be work? Yes. Will it be rewarding work? Absolutely no question. And over time, it will be very much worth the effort. Shackley family, we're a company on a mission to help people thrive, to realize their full potential, to create, help, to create healthier and better lives for everyone. But to achieve this mission at the level where we believe we should be, putting our fingerprints on this new decade, we each need to elevate our game, to bring our best and develop new bests. We'll need to lean in and to stretch and to develop new skills and ways of thinking and then to share them. We'll need to invite more good people to join us who care, who are willing to make the big, courageous decisions about their lives, who have a bias for action in order to change their lives and the lives of those they care about. And they'll want to join us because what we offer and the passion in how we offer it will be irresistible. That's what we need more of. So if you're waiting for an invitation to join us in this noble cause, don't wait any longer. This is your invitation. Decide. And as we close, remember, the best way to define this decade and your life is by creating it. It's all about imperfect, consistent, glorious action. Let's do this together.